Cybersecurity is all about risk management, doing some work, identifying what's important to protect, making sure that you have the processes and protect that. So spend a little time thinking about what you would do if something went wrong. That's my first piece of advice. DDC, Defending Digital Campaigns, is a nonprofit organization that helps campaigns on both sides of the aisle protect themselves. We're allowed to take the friction out of cybersecurity for campaigns by donating products directly to them. If you think about campaigns and elections, there's two different pieces, right? Election is the voting piece, and a lot of attention on security goes to that, and rightfully it should. And the integrity of that, obviously, is fundamental to our democracy. But campaigns are the marketplace of ideas. And that becomes a target because if you can interfere with that, you can interfere with the choices people are making. The basic fact is that they're the core of our democracy. And bad actors of all kinds could see disrupting campaigns as disrupting our democracy. Everybody that works on a campaign is what we call a high-risk user. They're very vulnerable. They're on the radar of all the bad actors. They're the target of cyber criminals. They're the target of nation states and the target of hacktivists. Security is not always top of mind for them. Cyber criminals go where the money is and campaigns have a lot of money. Nation states are looking for power. Campaigns have power and influence. And then there's hacktivists who want to make a point. And that's why DDC is here. Clearly, strong authentication was going to be one of the core things that we focused on. But not all MFA is created equal. For example, SMS texts are now shown to not be a reliable form of MFA. So our early efforts had to include companies like Ubico, who had the products that could bring us the strongest authentication possible directly into the hands of the campaigns. There are different risk profiles for different campaigns. From a presidential campaign on down ballot, they are gonna have different cybersecurity needs. But for every single campaign, we recommend enabling a security key. That is the number one thing. We really try to focus on products that had significant impact against the greatest threats that they face. One being authentication, strong authentication. Accounts always remain one of the most vulnerable and one of the most attacked places in an organization. The reason why we recommend YubiKeys is number one, it's very simple to implement and the level of security is substantially more. It's the best. It makes you virtually unfishable. One of the things that make YubiKeys valuable to what we do is that they're not devoted to one platform. Like Microsoft has Account Guard. If you have Account Guard and you use a YubiKey, you up your authentication. The same would be true on Google. It protects bank accounts and social media accounts and email. One of the things that campaigns really appreciate is how quickly we can send them keys. If they order them at 9 a.m. in the morning, they can have the key codes a few hours later, and then Yubico actually sends them the actual key overnight. When you look at the numbers, that feels like a win, and there's a lot more to go. DDC loves a secure and forward program. It has given us a primary person within Yubico who's 100% aligned with our mission. This is what collaboration and partnership is about. Our powers and our partners. The win is that joint mission and goal to secure our democracy, to make sure that both sides of the aisle have a fair shot at campaigning that's not being disturbed by outside bad malicious actors. Secure It Forward obviously does much more broader work than just DDC, and that we're part of that and working together toward this common goal is is really great. I mean, we love it. Something as simple as a security key, YubiKey, can save a life. It can save democracy. It can save some of the things that we care about the most.